here I am, starting my expedition to live off in the wilderness. Don't know how it's gonna be, what I'm gonna find, where I'm gonna go. But I'm just going to live, forget about the world and do, find out what life is really meant for. So let's go. I am Chris McCandless, and this is my story. Food and shelter. <sighs> Nietzsche once said, to live is to suffer. To survive is to find some meaning in the suffering. Do you hear that? That's a ma quack 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 darky. Native to these parts. I think there's a wild ostrich over there that sees me and is in feeding season. Because ostriches only eat one season of the year. Let's try to flank it over here. I've just been doing lots of philosophy and stuff. And I've worked up quite an appetite and haven't eaten in three months besides for raw berries and wood bark. I think it's time to find some food. Tupac once said, I don't have no fear of death. My only fear is coming back reincarnated. Just out here in the wilderness, you can do whatever you like. You can spit anywhere. You can masturbate whenever you want. It's basically like, like being single. I think I, I smell the stench of rotting boy. Let me go take a look. Maybe in this, this tall brush. Killed it. Now, to do the native Apahuacachawa Indian tradition of eating the heart. Oh, I'm full. The ostrich, it's back. I think I can get it this time. I'm eating good tonight. I think I heard a noise up in this brush. I'm gonna make my way up over this hill. See what lies beyond it.
think I'm more into the wild here than I've ever been. It's just some place where I'm truly at peace with myself. I understand the world. It just, everything just makes sense, you know? Get a burger. What is this? Stop this. Gigantic climax. And a wrap. <laughs>